Okay, in order to have a four screen setup for Forza 2 Motorsports, of course you have to have four Xboxes. So down here we have left, center, right, and over on the side here we have a fourth one which is our rear view mirror. Each box has to be connected to the internet via ethernet cable plugged into the Xbox and connected to the ethernet via hub. So all four of my boxes are plugged into a switch which is plugged into my internet. Once we have all the boxes physically connected to the internet, we start up all the boxes. Left, center, and right. And all the boxes will Come on. The next thing to do is to make sure that you have all the software for Forza, including extra car and track packs, installed identically on all four Xboxes. Any updates that Microsoft releases has to also be applied to all the boxes. We're going to set up each Xbox software to show it to be booting as a multi-screen client. So the box will default to its perspective right, notice here, or left, there's the rear screen. This one here is called the right screen. Over on this side, this one's called the left screen. And the main screen is the center screen. And how do we do that? I'll show you. You want to run Forza? Get the game going. From the main screen of the game, we want to migrate over, past career, past multiplayer, to options. We want to select options, and you'll notice that you can control all the various controller layouts, audio, HUD. Down at the bottom is the multi-screen setup. When we press that, we can turn on multi-screen. See it's toggled on or off. The center screen is the host. You'll pick a channel. It can be from 0 to 9. All the Xboxes have to have the same channel number. So set it to 1. In this case, this computer is the center. The degrees hidden and the degrees between the views or screens defaults to 0 and 60 degrees. This has to do with the overlap of the various screens and the size of the bezel. You'll want to place the screens at 60 degrees to one another in the way that I've shown. I'll give you a diagram at the end indicating how what the 60 degrees stands for. If you have some overlap between screens you can change the angle and the degrees hidden depending on the size of the bezel. But that's about it. So on my other screens instead of being center, the one on the right I'll select 
right, the one on the left, left, and my other one will be set up as a rear. It's just about that simple. You just have to have four copies of the game because a CD has to be in each game. I recommend loading each one into a hard drive, but it's not necessary. You also only need to be gold for the main screen to play online. You can be silver for left, right, center, and rear if you just want to have four screens. But the left, right, and rear only have to be silver. And that you just get email address and sign up. That's about it.